Sure, here's a short horror story. The Abandoned House. Emma had always been intrigued by the old abandoned house at the end of her street. It was rumored to be haunted, and kids in the neighborhood often dared each other to go inside and explore. Emma had never been brave enough to enter the house until one night when she was home alone and heard strange noises coming from outside. She decided to investigate and found herself standing in front of the old house. As she approached the front door, it creaked open on its own, inviting her inside. Emma hesitated for a moment, but then curiosity got the better of her, and she stepped inside. The house was dark and creepy, with cobwebs hanging from the ceiling and a musty smell in the air. Emma made her way through the living room and into the kitchen, where she saw a shadowy figure in the corner. She screamed and ran towards the front door, but it slammed shut in front of her. The figure emerged from the shadows, revealing a tall, thin man with a gaunt face and sunken eyes. He beckoned her closer. And Emma froze in fear. The man whispered something inaudible and lunged at her, his bony fingers wrapping around her neck. Emma struggled to break free, but she was no match for the man's strength. She felt her breath leave her body as he squeezed tighter and tighter. Just as she thought it was the end, the man suddenly released her and disappeared into the shadows. Emma ran out of the house as fast as she could, not stopping until she was safely back in her own home. From that day on, Emma never went near the abandoned house again. But she could never forget the terror she had experienced and the feeling of the man's cold, bony fingers around her neck.